Hi, I'm Arun Sanyal. I'm a professor of medicine and gastroenterology at Virginia Commonwealth University. Tom Boyer uh, asked me to help uh, edit uh, the Zakimian Boyer's textbook of liver diseases. This is a book that uh, many of us actually read many years ago when we were still early in our career. So it's a tremendous opportunity to participate uh, in this project, mainly because I believe it truly represents a true core resource text, uh, a go-to resource for anyone who wants to learn what's going on in the world of liver diseases. And uh, it, 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 the main advantage of this book is that it is, each chapter is written by a thought leader in the field who has pre-digested all of the available information and put it all together in a very comprehensive package. So if you want to learn about alcoholic liver disease, that's the book to go to because you have the world's best people who have written everything that is currently known, what is known and as well as what is not known in one place. Historically, the primary market has been people who are training in gastroenterology and liver diseases. Uh, and, you know, over the last 10 years, hepatology has evolved as a subspecialty unique within the field of gastroenterology. So it is beyond gastroenterology. But a lot of gastroenterologists have a substantial liver practice as well. So for anybody who sees more than 10 to 20 percent of their practice, in terms of liver patients will benefit from this book because you will run into situations where you want to know what to do and the book provides you the answers or the core knowledge and information that that'll help take care of those patients also for people in training this is a very valuable resource because it condenses all the information in one place and lastly for researchers particularly those who are doing basic science and do not have much contact with the clinical world. This book is, I think, an invaluable and maybe underutilized resource as a way for them to understand what are the burning questions on the clinical side that they can use their basic science talents to answer and ask the best quality questions. Well, I've been only involved with the last edition, and it was overall a very positive experience. And I think what we have to think about moving forward is the future of how people learn and use books and educational resources uh, in the context of a world full of Twitter, Facebook, et cetera, et cetera. And so we have to adapt, and, and the book has to evolve. The book is a living, dynamic thing. It's not something created in stone that will live in a, in, on stone. Uh, the book, by virtue of being a living dynamic thing that deals with living dynamic world around it, has to evolve. And I think I look forward to working with Elsevier in, in this evolution. Well, I think hepatology, liver diseases are underappreciated as a cause of morbidity and mortality in the general public. There is an extraordinary burden of disease in our communities around the world uh, related to liver disease. And I understand a lot of physicians are preoccupied with cardiovascular disease and you know cancers and this and that and nothing wrong with that but those diseases do deserve attention. However liver disease also deserves attention and it is under studied by many clinicians. Many clinicians lack awareness. There's a huge gap between the evidence base and guidelines that have been developed by various professional societies and the best practices that are out there. So I think where I would like to see a book like our book make a difference is to bridge the gap between practice and practice guidelines.